All right, in this video, I have a dry crushed walnut shell. It's very, very light in a 12 pound tumbler. And I'm going to put in a piece of uh, calcite and silver that I want rubbed down to shine it up. Um, and at the same time, just for fun, I've got some small pieces that I'm pretty sure have fair amount of silver in them, or nicolene, like like that. There's probably a piece of cobalt. Um, and I'm going to dry tumble them in the tumbler. Let's see how this goes. I'll put them in for perhaps a week and then take a look. Well, let's check out how these bad boys are doing. This is a 12 pound tumbler. I can see that the Rocks have shined a bit, and they've cleaned off some of the tarnish, but they're also stained. That's nice, eh? They're also stained where they're rough with the walnut shell. It's like digging for buried treasure, eh? Wow. Now we're down to some small ones. So, I'll use a, maybe a toothbrush and soap and water and clean these things up and really see how they turned out. Well, let's do a quick look how things turned out. This one you can really see the dendritic silver. There's the skin. Another one, not dendritic, but awfully nice. This one. Hopefully we can see it's pretty sparkly. Uh, very cool. Get down in some little ones. That is a little plate of silver. Is the big boy. Huh. Some very cool nuggets. I think this is one of my favorite. Hopefully you can see that. And then, an assortment of others. The real idea that I had was to gently uh, rub them so I can see what I'm dealing with. Like that one is mostly uh, nicolene. Uh, this one, cobalt. So now I know at least what the rocks are. And I can make further decisions what I'm going to do with them. But it gently rubbed it. If I put it into the rock tumbler with water, it, uh, you know, water and grit and that sort of thing, it would have smoothed these things around. 
which isn't a bad look, but uh, I don't know. It's uh, it's it's not the most effective way of treating them, but uh, it it did what I wanted it to do. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. I enjoyed making it. Uh, thanks for watching.